Hey, my friend, this is Pastor Mike. And one of the things that marks our time is the word endurance. It takes endurance from every single one of us to move through these challenging times, all the changes we're experiencing, and the losses that we've experienced as well. It's a time of endurance to find a deeper sense of strength within us to keep moving forward. Endurance and the word endure is an interesting word with its etymology. It comes from the French and the Latin, which both mean to harden. Think about that for a second, that endurance does something within us. It strengthens us within that challenge to keep us moving forward. It makes us harder, not in a bad way necessarily, but so that we get stronger so when the next challenge happens, we have more endurance to go through that too. Endurance shows up best in times when we're challenged. It makes us stronger. So this morning I was reading in my devotions Psalm 136, and the word endure and endurance shows up 26 times because at the end of each verse, there's a refrain in that psalm that says, God's love endures forever. God's love endures forever. So as we are experiencing times of endurance, God's love endures. And like I said, endurance shows up best in times of challenge. That we don't have endurance in times when it's easy, necessarily. We always do have endurance, but when we're challenged, that's when endurance takes over. We, we're feeling weak and something strong, the strength happens to keep us moving forward. And God's love is like that. God's love, his steadfast love, endures. It sticks through the difficult times with us. It endures, it moves through the challenging times with us. It endures, it moves through the changes that we're experiencing. God's love endures through the losses that we're experiencing too. And God's love becomes stronger in us in challenging times like this. God's love endures. It is that rock upon which we stand and live. God's love is that place where we live out of. God's love endures forever. God's not absent from times of challenge, but instead God's love endures through the challenge with us, becoming stronger inside us as we find God more faithful, especially in difficult times. At the end of that psalm, it says this, the psalmist says, to the one that is God who remembered us in our low estate, that God met them in their low estate, his love endures forever, and freed us from our enemies, his love endures forever, the psalmist says, his love endures endures forever, freed us from our enemies. When we are facing our enemies, the challenge from our enemies, God's love endures in those times too. So my friend today, if you're having a difficult day, God's love endures with you right now. It endures inside you right now. Because as Psalm 136 says, God's steadfast love endures forever and ever.